and he had his glove on the other hand. Doesn't he have to pitch like that? <laughs> this is wiffle ball. And can he turn around during the at bat? From what I understand, Benditti's father, when he was growing up in Nebraska, oh, he's switching. We got we pushed got a little him to do this. How about this? Did he change sides again? He switched sides again. <laughs> <laughs> now he's I've never seen anything like it. And he's going back again. Oh now this is become this is becoming a comedy show right here. Let's let's take take the, the viewers through this here. He came up as a right hander. But on deck he Henry was a gets, lefty. Okay. And then he switched over. <laughs> well it's okay if you're on deck as a lefty, but right. then when you get up there if you switch fine, but now that he he started to, to go back and forth, righty lefty, righty lefty. And obviously, Venditti after a while thought, this isn't funny. And now he's been standing out there for about five or six minutes with both arms in the seat. After all of this is that the Cyclones are down to their final out of the game, trailing at 7-2. Here in the bottom of the ninth inning with a runner on first, Giapudo and Ralph Enriquez takes the first pitch from the right-hander for a strike. I'd like to see him mess with him right here and just throw one lefty, just a <laughs> little gamesmanship. In there for a call strike two, and so the Cyclones are down to their final strike of the night. And the 0-2 pitch. Up high, way out of the zone. One and two. I would imagine after this, they'll get these rules. Uh, a little bit more clarified. Breaking ball swung on and missed, and that is going to do it. When it was all said and done, some sweet revenge for Vendee. Sweeping curveball. Tough way for the cycle.